today we're going to talk about how to convince a customer to buy from you. Hey everybody, it's me, Henry, and welcome to my channel. And this is the channel that helps you to improve your speaking skills. And if you are new here, please consider to hit the subscribe button and turn on all the notifications. And today, we're gonna talk about how to convince a customer to buy from you. So you need to stay until the end of this video and to learn all the tips to apply to your next sales presentation or your next sales call. Now, at this point, I assume you already achieved the level of your customers they know you they like you they trust you and I assume your product or your service is good quality and your price is reasonable and right now we are talking into the closing part so during the closing part most of the people only provide one solution or one product one service well if it is only one choice your customers their focus is only on one product whether i want to buy it or not is the price is too expensive or can i compare with the other so at this point what you can do is to have a little technique to play around on the options this is what i call it as the magic three so why i name it as the magic three in the short while i'm going to explain to you if only one choice your customers most of the time their focus will be more on the price if two options they would choose whether i want to choose a or b so if you can have the third option this will be perfect i'm going to explain to you why in a short while so if only have one a and b i would choose whether a or b if the third one i'll design b is the above average a little bit and a is just nice it is a, a entry level and the c is the most luxurious package the super combo the jumbo so most of the people at this point they would choose just nice uh, i'm gonna pick the average one let me put an example when you go for movie cinema usually the popcorn they will have three options a is for a, a single person individual only one person that your package your size is just nice it's only one box and one bottle of water or a soft drink and for package b is a little bit bigger and you will think it is worth i just talk about a little bit one or two dollar and the size is much more bigger than the entry level or the individual the single one so i would choose the middle one and the third one the option three that will be a super jumbo is the biggest size and you will never finish it even you together with the family and from here you will see the business strategy they are targeting on the middle one so if you are selling a solution if you are selling a product during the closing part what you can say is you're going to offer to your customers well you know what mr prospect and i have three options the option b it is just nice and suit to your needs and this is solution you're looking for and i would probably say this is worth for your choice for your budget and more than often most of the customers they will pick the middle one and from the market research they are approximately 20 percent of the people uh, you would name it as the rich people they would choose the luxurious one now give me the best give me the most expensive package i'll just take the most expensive package well you can see this is the option how you're gonna play around the focus on the option but not on the other consideration whether i want to compare with other product whether i want to go home and ask my wife or my family members so you can eliminate on this focus on the a b or c most of the people they would target on the b well let me cut you another example during shopping online especially when you are going to purchase a smartphone so in a smartphone they will give you three options option a it is just nice it is the entry level it's the cheapest one basic entry price and option b i'll give you some free gift for the extra warranty time perhaps another plus one year 
and option three is the super jumbo and it is the most expensive one and as for option three i'm gonna give you the best free gift and i'm gonna give you the phone case and the screen protector and the power bank and all the best gift that you can imagine i'm gonna check in into the package three and it is the most expensive package now they are 20% of the people, they might choose the expensive one. Now, to me, I am a seller. I'll be glad if you choose the third one. The yeah, option three is, this, I make the, the biggest profit. And if you choose the middle one, which is in my plan, this is what I'm gonna target. I wanna target to sell plan B, the package B to the buyers. So you can see as a sales person or the one going to provide the solution, usually we will give options for the customers for them to choose even if you look at the insurance they'll give you the option based on your budget 150 dollars is this package 200 dollars is this package and 300 dollars is the best package suit for your budget so most of the time people they will choose the middle one well, from here, I guess you have some basic ideas on how you're gonna design your sales technique on how to convince a customer to buy from you. So next time, you can have three options. Now, let me tell you why three options. If only one option is two less. Two, well, maybe, okay. Three is the best. More than three, that will be a little bit confused. Now, remember this, confuse mind, don't buy. So three options is the best technique to me to convince your customers to buy from you. So you can apply this in your next appointment and I wish you can succeed in your next sales presentation. And if you find values and learn something from this video, you gotta smash the subscribe button and turn on all the notifications so that you're not gonna miss out any videos just like this from this channel. And most importantly is to leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. I would love to read the comment and reply to your comment. And I hope to see you in the next video.